Hey everyone, um, I'm just wanting to do another update because I know that my last video wasn't very long at all and I apologize. Um, I was having a really bad day. <laughs> it was a bad morning. I just wasn't feeling good at all. But um, So I wanted to do another video and um, today I'm six weeks and six days. So tomorrow I'll be seven weeks. And on um, next Thursday, we'll be getting our first ultrasound and also get to hear the heartbeat. So I'm really super excited. Um, right now I'm nannying. Again, I nanny like every single day. I don't have one day that I don't have kids here. Um, it's better than getting a, a real job and I make more money doing this, watching three kids than I would working eight hours a day at some fast food joint or some job that I hated. So this is fine by me. Um, anyway, um, my mood swings came back, uh, which I told you about. But um, the weird thing is, is that yesterday I was in an awful mood. Like, I mean, God awful mood. Um, I wanted to kill my dog. I actually texted my husband and was like, we're getting rid of the dog. <laughs> he was eating poopy diapers that I had put out in the garage. Um, I tie them up in bags and just put them to the side and then my husband takes them out to the trash when he gets home or in the morning because I don't like to open the trash because the smells make me gag. So anyway, the dogs got into about three or four bags of poopy diapers and ate baby poop and then smeared the diapers all over the garage. That was just peachy. So you can imagine that, uh, yeah, I wanted to kill the dogs and get rid of them. Um, but after that, my mood, uh, I did take back our new car. I told you guys we got a new car and I took it back um, because we were getting an 09 Escape that had 14,000 miles on it. It was used. And they wanted $28,000 for it. Well, we found a 2010 brand new Ford Escape with like three miles on it. And they only wanted 23, I think. So yeah, pretty much they were trying to screw us and I wasn't gonna stand for it. So took it back, got my cars back. So happy about that. Um, now we just have to keep looking for another car. No biggie, we got eight months. <laughs> um, so anyway, um, what was the point of my story? I can't remember. Oh, my mood, right. So I took the car back. Once I got my car back, I don't know what it was, but like some magic switch and I was in the best mood ever. Like I just had so much energy for the first time and I, I don't know, I came home. I had a screaming, crying baby and a toddler who just screamed because he could and it was okay. Like, I calmed him down. We went outside, and everybody was hunky-dory, and then I started cleaning the house, and they kept themselves entertained, and I got a lot done, and I felt really good. And so that was nice, and today it's continued. I've been in a really good mood all day. Went grocery shopping, and I bought a lot of healthy foods with a lot of the vitamins and um, like calcium and iron and everything that I need. Um, and I read up in my pregnancy book and read what was changing in my body and my baby this week. And they are right. I have gained a few pounds, which sucks, but I better get used to it. <laughs> so, but um, I also have started doing some cardio. Just um, when I have the kids um, hit a nanny, I just put them in a stroller and we go walking around the block for like 25 minutes and that's my cardio for the day and that's about all I need. Um, I do want to come home and do like crunches and stuff because my abs were like the number one thing that I'm so scared of losing. <laughs> I worked so hard on them and 
yeah, I got married and then I don't know what happened. So we'll see <laughs> if I ever get back to it. Um, hopefully one day. But um, so I guess that's about all that's new. So um, tune in next week on uh, next Thursday. I'll put a new video and have a heartbeat and a picture. Bye, guys.